SCP-3700 might be one of the scariest SCPs of all time. And today, we're gonna be learning why. Two massive creatures are locked in a fight to the death in the middle of the sea. Oh, it's a giant oh, crab and a giant sea serpent. Cruisers and battleships fire special weapons and harpoons at one of the creatures. Take them out. Attempting to help turn so the So right off the bat, guys, favorite. who do you think's winning the battle? There's it two different like SCPs. The, the giant serpent thing, I think. You think so? Adam? No. Claws always win. I'm going crab man. All right, boys. One but they appear to have almost no effect on the gigantic monster. <laughs> wow, Hi. they're so big. I'm Dr. Yeah. Bob. Humans are kind of a joke. And this is SCP-3700, yeah. also known as the Tides, Tides of, of War. War. It's one of the scariest SCPs I've ever heard of. SCP-3700 is what the SCP Foundation has labeled an 800 kilometer circular area in the North Sea. So it's kind of like the Bermuda Triangle a little bit. Just like a lot of bad stuff happens in this certain area out in the middle of nowhere. And it lives in the water? Yeah, yeah. It's two aquatic ocean creatures that are massive. They're kind of like it, Godzilla. Like I was going to say, that reminds me of Godzilla, bro. A little bit. Dude, if, little... if Godzilla wakes up from this too, he's going to destroy both of them easy. You haven't even he very well. <laughs> Yeah. Doesn't matter. Godzilla's OP. Godzilla's now, OP. Godzilla Alec, lost to uh, King Kong, so shut up. I will say, these creatures, they have some pretty insane powers. Located we'll learn about those. Located southeast of Iceland and north of the United Kingdom, the circle contains the Faroe, Orkney, and Shetland Islands. The seafloor is abnormally deep in this area at roughly five kilometers below the ocean surface. Oh, it's really roughly deep. Roughly 20 times deeper than the rest of the North Sea. So yeah, it's a giant like crater SCP under the water. I have a theory. The Adam? SCPs, the reason that there's a crater down there is because the SCPs are from space and they came down in a meteor and boom, that's what made that little crater. Oh, interesting. And then or, that's why or. that area is the SCP No, 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 I know. It's because your mom went on a boat out there and did a cannonball. And the cannonball made a giant crater. <laughs> it's got to be that. No. It's got to be what? that. Maybe, but no. I agree with that. 100 experiences all kinds See? of strange, anomalous activity, including extreme weather and geological events. Oh, geological. These are caused by the interaction between two separate entities, which have been designated as SCP-3700-1 okay, and SCP-3700-2. Wow, very creative names. SCP-3700-1 <laughs> like is maybe. an arthropod resembling the common... Well, there we go. We're seeing him for the first time. This it's literally a giant lobster. Six kilometers long. long, boys. This is my guy. Alec, now's your chance to switch teams. Do it right now. Six kilometers long? Yeah, come on. It's big. Come on. And it has a drawing of a woman on it. That is literally insane. Are you switching Alex, teams? Alex, do you like women? women? It's on the thing. It's on the shell of the giant Kraken lobster. Oh, that's pretty epic. But no, my giant serpent is way longer than six kilometers, and it's known as the woman destroyer. I don't know. Yeah, I, don't, I, I, I did just make that, that up. up. All right, let's learn up. how big it actually is. It has a variety of blue, yellow, pink, and red Who drew that? It looks like a, into its carapace. Looks like it a child, child drew that. It has it six arm-like limbs, four of which kid. have claws, with it two having cord-like appendages on the end, and eight legs. Go ahead. It also has Ooh. four orange eyes at the end Ooh. of four eyes. That's, that's kind of nasty. Four eyes. carapace shows <laughs> significant damage, with many scars, cracks, and even I some like holes that reveal its soft inner tissue. That's from all the battles that it's won. It has look several it anomalous is. capabilities that it uses in its battle Yo! against SCP. That snake. Okay, if my guy is six kilometers, just imagine how big your guy is, Alec. Actually. I think I he know. might be bigger. I think my guy could probably eat yours in one big bite. Like, that's what snakes do. They, they just gobble them up. It looks like my dude's entire body is already in frame, but it looks like only like 10% of yours is. That's only the tip of my neck. I still got my whole body, my body, my tail. But he doesn't Come have any on. arms, so you're trash. Oh, it's true. Like it's more of a snake. Capable of striking, <laughs> He's just smacking me. A cavitation oh. bubble Whoa. that what generates that? a force oh, wow. equal Special to seven kami hami haji. Similar to what the mantis shrimp is able to do, but oh on a wow, much Logan Paul would scale. love this. A mantis shrimp can actually do that. Two of its eyes are able to project no concentrated blasts of gamma rays. Oh, you're done. What? You're done. It's you're done. To stop storm so far, it's looking phenomena. like that first SCP is the Despite winner. Despite being six kilometers long, look at how fast it is. It looks so tiny. Can reach speeds faster than 100 kilometers per hour. That is way faster hour. than Alec can run. Let's run. go. Even shown the ability to demand That's only 60 miles per hour. If it doesn't locate SCP-3702 within roughly 15 days okay. after appearing. SCP-3701 appears to be friendly in nature and That's shows so weird. some small signs Most of Most SCPs are not friendly. When accompanied <laughs> by Foundation. It only, it's like Adam because it only shows small signs of intelligence. <laughs> no wonder Adam, you picked this one, Adam. Oh, Adam. No Adam, wonder you picked this Adam knows how to pick them, let me tell you. Not, I don't even think Adam say. can hear us. No, he's so dumb. It will either ignore them or provide a small amount of aid by helping to move disabled craft oh, away oh, from danger. That's actually really nice. After appearing, Good job, it Adam. travels the full 800-kilometer 
area of SCP-3700. Wow. Is it going to make so it hard? It's making it hard. Oh, from the oh. center out toward the Alex. edge. Interestingly, what? the it's center is the exact heart. center point between the three island chains located within the circle. It is home to numerous Dude, he's almost as big as the entire island. You see that? Yeah, I mean, he's six yes. kilometers long. That's pretty big. That's, that's bigger than a lot of islands, probably. Yeah, it's bigger than Since my island. Since being first discovered by the Foundation in 1922, 3701 has slowed down considerably in its movement and uh -huh. has lost a significant oh, wait, amount of mass. Mine. That's your guy. It was first yeah, measured at a length leaves. of 16 kilometers. Small signs of intelligence. Whoa! Whoa! longer than its current state. It also appears nah. weaker, He's so and tiny seems to be now. having much harder time <laughs> subduing SCP-3702. <laughs> oh, no. He can't subdue I my guy. Oh, here's your guy. On the other hand. You know what's like the most crazy about these things is they could be real. I know that they're probably not, but humans have only explored, what, like 5% of the ocean? Who knows what the heck is down there? The ocean's we big, it's dark, it's deep, and it is very mysterious. Literally, things like that could exist down there. We would never know. I kind of... Looks like it, it makes belongs me go to the, in the family of ray finned fish and has an appearance that closely resembles the pelican eel. I could see why Alec liked this. that it has 13 appendages I call circling it the middle the gobbler. section of its body. Ew. These appendages and also look the, like the tickler, tentacles of an the octopus, tickler gobbler. Oh, it's so gross. And can tuck them into suckers. its body when not in use. Ew. Oh. Ew. Is He's so hairy. 32 kilometers. To SCP <laughs> no. It is growing larger, having only been 300 meters long when first identified in 1945. Oh, it started as just oh, a baby. Growing. Most of that length is the creature's whip-like tail that ends in a sharpened point. Wow, it's huge. It is, Dude, it is so big. 32 kilometers of whippage it does, and then at the very end, it's got a very sharp, like, end of the tail. And it also has the it's tentacles that can suck. The succulent tentacles? That's my favorite part. So I if don't my know. Crab, if don't my know crab lobster is. guy doesn't defeat this lizard-looking dude soon, he's never going to be able to feed him, because this guy just keeps getting bigger and bigger. Why my guy's shrinking? Your guy's yeah. getting smaller and smaller. Kind of like real life. Alex getting bigger, Adam's getting smaller. Yeah, right it's now, if that's happening. one kilometer wide at its largest nah. point. And each of its 13 tentacles is around 60 meters long. That's above its average. Its most distinctive feature is its massive mouth, which oh, can yeah. open up almost three kilometers wide. How many teeth are in there? Wow. <laughs> okay, I understand why Alex loves white, this thing. Purple, oh, yeah, anything can fit in there. Lines that resemble a man's face three on either side of its big. torso. So it's a man SCP versus a woman. See, I told you, my, my guy's definitely going to win. Fight, generating huge storms and, and category five hurricanes, as well as massive It's all about world domination. That suck in any vessel within 150 meters. Dude, he, this guy just loves sucking. Tentacles and tearing them apart. Oh, my God. oh he's evil. It's, he's evil. He's basically the crack to produce high energy sound waves and streams of blue fire. Kind of reminds me of like a demo dog. Uses to destroy close range targets. Except times a million. SCP-3700 and has nothing to do with them dogs. Their faces the look kind of like the same. Area, except during the spring and autumn equinoxes, when it appears at the exact center of SCP-3700. It stays submerged. Oh, here we go. Battle Jack, time. Jack, did you pick your team yet? No, I can't. I know who's, who wins. I've seen this. Jack, join me, Jack. Join me. I, Adam, trust me. I can't. I can't. <laughs> I can't. I'm so sorry. All right. All right. Oh my All right. gosh. Fine. You know I'm going to win though, Jack, right? You know? Jack! <laughs> Did anybody hear that? Or Here we go. Object. Wow, my guy's way smaller than I thought. Days after He's going to get gobbled up in one it's second. extremely hostile to any Whoa. creature or object that approaches it. He's and mean. Look at that. What a beast. We all know mean guys never win. Conventional he literally destroys no entire bars of whales, bro. And anomalous weapons Dude. used by the Foundation have only had a moderate effect. Yep, only 3,700 won has so far been Yay! able to subdue it. When SCP-3701 and 3,702 <laughs> do meet bears. each other, they will engage in a prolonged fight, with each attempting to temporarily kill or subdue That's the other. That's not gonna work. Historically, gonna work. the winner of each contest would swap depending on which half of the year it was, with 3,701 consistently winning during the Northern Hemisphere's spring and summer. <laughs> Uh, and 3,702 oh, wow. winning during the fall oh. and winter. Yeah! So I guess they get more power the during the different seasons. Wait, so how many times have these guys fought? I don't know. It sounds like um they fought a lot of times. Kind of like uh, Vatu and Rava from the Avatar series. It's like an endless battle that they just keep fighting over and over again every single year. They should just like make up and kiss and stuff. As much as I like SCP-3701, eventually he's not going to be big enough to be able to beat SCP-3702. Adam, I know that took a lot of brain power to get out, and I agree. 
agree. So this might be the time where the tides turn for SCP-3701. I'm going to need you to calm down before your head explodes, because, dude, you got it. You're, you're spitting facts right That's now. That's a really big number for Adam, guys. Give them all, everyone give him a round of applause. SCP-3701 has won the last 64 cycles in a row. A number of changes happen 64 when cycles. wins. When 3701 is yeah. successful, major yeah. storms in the area immediately cease. Crop yields double. So it's a good thing. And local oceanic yeah. life increases Thank their you. Reproductive He's a good guy. He's a good guy. Three. Yeah, Alec, you're this on the can evil lead team. To dead zones I'm on from the, the good team. The, 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 the overpower team. Evil never Erosion wins. rates on the islands also increase by a factor of five, which has led to the foundation needing to bring in large amounts of dirt and sand oh, in an attempt to combat. You're a bully, Alec. When SCP-3702 wins and subdues or kills 3701, the weather becomes Wait, yeah. very dangerous Wait, they kill each other? with powerful hurricanes. They, like, temporarily kill each other. Wait, see, when your guy wins, like, he does some good stuff, but a lot of bad stuff happens, too, like erosion and stuff. See? It's not all, it's not all, all good. black and white. No, it's Idiot. not. There's some gray stuff. Changes ...that can range from below zero Enough. to over 28 degrees Celsius, capable oh, of causing cool. massive damage to buildings and huge that, losses that's of That's not very good. Okay, yeah, well, where's the good? There's got to be some good that happens. Difficult due to it's Huge waves and storm worse and worse. surges. Okay, we're going on a cruise soon, and that I don't want to see that. Yeah, that's Ocean scary. Resources are I think we're actually going the area past that area. Crop yields are reduced following its victory. Oh, the trip. 3702 does not demanifest and instead continues to patrol the area and attack vessels. Oh, wow. And even approach the islands themselves. Oh, my gosh. The cruise oh, okay. ship. Like okay. okay. I've heard zero Delta good things. Seven, nicknamed Northern Storm, is tasked with locating and assisting SCP 37. What are they going to do with those puny little guns? Bro, my guy is 32 kilometers long. What is that little harpoon going to do? They're not they have to that try. Going to do? What do you want them to do? Nothing? He literally wouldn't even feel it. He wouldn't even know if they shot him. Um, yeah. Can you imagine? Like, close your eyes and think about being 32 kilometers long. Oh. Whoa. 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 Everything's so small. You see? You guys get it now? What are the little harpoons going to do? They're not going to Oh, God, Adam. Adam, what did you find? Did you find what two happened? big boulders? Okay, I think Adam's too big for his own good. Snap back. Oh, my gosh. It's still tiny. Well, <laughs> against 3,702. Purchased from the United States military, it consists of 13 destroyers, five cruisers, and 15 wow. smaller support That's going to do that a nothing. Delta 7 it's a whole SCP armada. It will often acknowledge their presence by raising two of its claws into the air Aww. and clicking them while making a What's up, boys? Hey, guys. my friends. Delta 7 Hi, guys. Then accompanies SCP-3701. Oh, yeah, we got allies. Alec, you have no friends. I don't need friends, boy. Troy, you're 32 kilometers long. Meet. <laughs> Delta 7 engages in protocol okay, Winter Maelstrom, where the destroyers Ooh. shoot harpoon based anchors in yeah, the 37 shoot him with your poon. head before moving in a circular pattern while they and battleships fire on it to ensure like an endless butthole. That's about to be GG's for you, Alec. The cruisers, meanwhile, attempt to draw oh, its attention by firing and moving in a serpentine pattern <laughs> the at a do distance absolutely of 300 nothing. meters. <laughs> the two creatures will battle, blasting each other yeah. with gamma radiation and Blast powerful him. sound waves. It's working. They whip, bite, and club each other. Cracking armor oh, and wow. ripping off wow. holes and other no. appendages. No, oh! no, no! Finally stops moving. Oh no! And dissolves into the oh, sea. No. Oh no! Wait. Should SCP-3702 be successful in defeating 3701, then Seems Project like Tumult was. is activated, and the following procedures must take place. Crap! First, there is an immediate evacuation I think of we all did naval it. and civilian craft. I think so. Uh, okay, why is there so many civilians going in that area when they know it's that dangerous? That's that's pretty irresponsible. I mean, yeah. Well, it seems like they have a plan in place now, which is good, to evacuate the area. 100-kilometer zone. <laughs> Next, all trade and ferry routes are stopped or good rerouted call, for at least six months and land-based aquatic defenses are activated. Aerial craft will continue to monitor and engage with 3702, while others continue to look for a reappearance of SCP-3701. Since it appears that SCP-3701 continues to physically degrade and with the exact That's opposite so being true for 3702, it. it's been proposed to let 3702 win and subdue 3701 twice every five years, Whoa. despite the terrible effect oh, wow. on locals in the area. Though this plan has yet to be approved, it may be the only chance to stop 3702 from becoming so strong. Okay, what is this angle we're getting right now? He's OP. He's you don't a, like it, bro? He's a secret man. We can't know his real identity. I can tell. It's not Professor Oak. It's Professor 3701 is never able to defeat it again. 
Wow. And boys, that is it. Now you know everything there is to know about SCP-3700, and you don't have to be scared of the ocean anymore. Or maybe you do. All I know you. is that my dude destroyed Adam's dude. Get wrecked, Elmozo! Yeah! Hey guys, if you enjoyed, leave a like on today's video and click right on Adam's face to see more. Pick bros. <laughs>